Hey, what is some of my name is Vine. Today I have some Call of Duty Wait, this is in the right game. There we go, that's much better. We're actually on some Black Ops 3 for today, and I've actually been playing this game quite a bit more as of recently. I've been having some fun with the game, and yeah, it just brings back some good old memories of when this game initially came out, because I just remember when the game first came out, getting the game, grinding it out, and it just, I had a lot of fun in this game. I have a lot of good memories, and it feels good to go back to it. But yeah, in this video, I want to talk about will Black Ops 3 be continued in development in 2018? Of course, as we all know, COD 2017 or World War 2 is coming out in just a couple of weeks, which is kind of insane that it's coming out this soon, um, which I'm very, very excited for the game. But overall, even though the game is coming out this soon, are Treyarch going to continue to support the game even throughout World War 2's life cycle? Now, I do imagine whenever we get the release or the reveal for whatever uh, COD 2018 is going to be, and um, we're not really going to see too much support for Black Ops 3, but will we see it before that? Like, say, in a couple of weeks, whenever World War 2 comes out, are we going to see more support, more weapons, more stuff added to the game every single week? Like, so far we've got, like, different featured game modes going on where you got double XP, double uh, crypto keys and different things, um, which are very good and it continues to support the game for people who want to play the game, get that little bit of an extra reward. But will we continue to see this support throughout 2017 or 2018 even and um, with World War II? Now, personally, as I said, whenever we get the reveal for COD 2018, I don't think we're gonna actually see too much support for this game or any support for the game. But I do think maybe there might be a little bit of support um, during COD World War II's life cycle because there's gonna be people who don't like World War II and there's gonna be people who specifically buy Call of Duty and play Call of Duty for Treyarch games only and for the people who still enjoy Black Ops 3 till the day or till this day and want to play the game they still have an option to go play it and they have more support and more items and more things to basically go for in the game. Overall, I can't really answer this too well because, of course, I don't know. Personally, I don't think there will be too much support for the game. I think there might be another weapon drop. And if there is another weapon drop before Call of World War 2, it's gonna be pretty soon because Call of Duty World War 2 is coming out very soon. I can't imagine them dropping another, like, weapon drop and some more weapons literally just, like, a couple of days or even, like, a week before uh, World War 2 comes out. I don't imagine that. I imagine if they do, it'll be very very soon but if you don't buy then I don't think there's going to be too much support for the game throughout World War 2's life cycle but anyway guys that's pretty much all I had to say hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and yeah I'll see you guys next one peace out